Hey everybody, Nostalgia Scott comes to you guys with part 5 of Spyro 2 Season of Flame for the Game Boy. So, today we'll be doing Tiki Tropics, the level that I, for some reason, always forget about in this world. Despite being a very interesting level, I guess. It's nothing too fancy, nothing too crazy. Uh, we do need the flame breath for this one, though. And we'll talk to this elephant guy. Welcome to our humble temple, little purple traveler. We have picked the, the very worst day possible for your visit. We have been hiding from those cursed Rhinox and have been unable to take care of the temple. Now our paths are overgrown with vines and we cannot have our parade. What an awful state of affairs. Yeah, I, I, I get it. We torch them. That's why I have the flame breath out. Also, those are the enemies from the uh, mouse level back, the uh, dune level. Also, I feel like that music doesn't really fit this level. Like, not gonna lie. Wait, why does those the Wungaga sounds from um, Crash Bandicoot? Wait. Why do I have... Why are there two buttons that are flame breath? I don't have that set up like that. That's weird. That is the weirdest thing ever. At least this game does the gold gems as gold gems, unlike, uh... Um, so you stopped to talk to me so I could get hurt, right? Nice. I love when the game, like, screws you by giving you advice mid-enemy attack. This isn't the only game that does that, but boy does it happen a lot. And, oh, looks like we need our ice breath. Fuller Flicker. I thought we already had one named Flicker, but I guess that's not the case. Uh, which ways that we need to go? I think this way, right? I think this is the pathway we or platform we want to end up on. Ow, we got smoked. I need some HP because I didn't kill a lizard when I was... Yeah, well, at least we got a checkpoint. The annoying part is now, though, is the fact that we can't pick up gems with sparks. I still find it funny, though, how sparks works better in this game than uh, he does in the Reignited Trilogy. That's... That's saying something, man. Ah, oh, we died because I missed him. Boop. Well, at least we got health now, so at least now we can pick up gems. Ooh, a 25 gem. That's pretty big. I love finding those big gems in Spyro. They're always just so satisfying, you know? And oh, at least we got health again. It's like we never even took damage. I wish this game didn't seem so, like... It's not framey, it's just... It's always like this, where it seems like it's kind of jittery. Like there's so much going on on such a small screen. So sometimes it's kind of hard to follow what's going on, but you'll get used to it. Just try not to get motion sickness. Okay, these guys, for whatever reason, can hit you with their flame not actually touching you. That's great to know, game. I love your BS nonsense. Also, why are the butterflies blue in this game when they're not blue naturally? The blue ones are, have always been one-ups, so I don't know why they changed it for these games, but... It's whatever floats their boat. Oh, hang on. We got another little buddy here. We have Glitter. Eh, I guess that name fits, too. Hey, it's this guy. I'm pretty sure this is the one that needs us to clear out all the vines, I think? I don't even know. These levels are a lot bigger than one would think. Okay, right, and so that's that loop around spot. Or maybe he just tells us about the, uh... I, I, I touched him and took damage. Man, I'm an idiot. Woongago. Hey, a key! Despite not having seen a, a chest yet, that's something, I guess. Oh yeah, there's these things we have to flame, but we have to use the ice breath to get to them. That's un kind of an annoying challenge, not because it's hard, but because it's just tedious. I believe we have to go back this way. The music in this game is pretty decent, though. Yeah, we need to stay up here. Whoa, the frame drops. There's too much going on in the screen at once. 
And I wanted to kill you, but... Uh, whatever. Twinkle, 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 little star. How I hate catching dragonfly or fireflies. Hey, look, the chest. We actually had the key before we got to the chest, which is something that usually very rarely happens in Spyro games. Oh, Mr. Tiki Boy over here trying to do some good damage to us. That should be the last of vines. Let's go talk to one of those elephant dudes and tell him the road's clear. Elephant dudes? I mean this one right here? I'm pretty sure we talked to this guy, right? Oh wait, that was the um Was it was it this one? We have burner. Oh no, it was this one. Ah. Scarlet, that's funny. They were both like right next to each other like that. That was ridiculous. Oh, great blessings be upon you. You have once again opened the pathways we could hold a parade at last. Let me offer you the shining light to aid you in your meditation. Oh goodness, it has gotten away from me. It's trying to leave the level, everybody. We have Gleam. Now there's only one more... Clearly there's only one more, um... Uh, dragon or firefly thingy of bobber because we have to go over here and then do these guys oh yeah we gotta hit it a third time because why not Ugh, flame breath attack I forget how many there are or I think there's four right I think that's what the game said oh god don't fall in the water now I got an itchy nose Actually, it, I, it doesn't say. Never mind. I'm not going crazy. It didn't say what how many there were. But I know where the other one is. It's over this way. Do 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 do. Yeah, it was over this way, right? Yeah, it was right here. Da -na -na. Is that not the last one? Hmm. Oh wait, hang on, here we go. And there we go! And we gotta freeze that before... Ooh boy. How many gems are we missing? Let's see... We're missing 30 still, and that's a... Uh, pretty big amount, I guess. I don't know where they could be, because I don't really remember seeing any place that these gems could have been hiding in. Oh, wait, hang on, there's a 5 right there that I missed. Well, it's still 20... Wait a minute, it's still 25. That seems oddly suspicious. Like, one of these towers may or may not have a 25 sitting on top of it. Definitely not that one, because it's what the 25 was the first time. God, I sometimes hate, like, the 3D angle that they do. Butterfly. I know we can go down there for the, the firefly, but I kind of want to look for... any form of gem. Okay, not up there. Not in here, by chance. Oh, I bet you it's... Oh, wait a second. I'm pretty sure it's that right there, right? Aha! I knew it. And then we can go and talk to this elephant dude over here. Are we on ice breath? No, we are not. You did it! Thanks for your help. I was getting pretty worried there. Here, take this bright spark-like object that flew off one of the torches. Whoa there! That thing is completely out of control. And we have Swelter. Now, did we actually do the homeworld in the last episode or not? I don't know if we actually beat Celestial Plains or not. Or whatever it's called. I'm pretty sure it's Celestial Plains, right? Did we take damage or was that just indicating that we ate a butterfly? I've never paid attention to the 
the sparks icon down below when we get a butterfly when we're at full health. Pretty sure we were at full health. Anyways, let's leave this level and go on to the next one. Which could be... No, we did, we did. We explored the entire home world, I'm pretty sure, then did some backtracking. And then remember that I forgot this level. So now we're at 2300 gems, which isn't too bad. All right, um, now the atlas, oops, keep forgetting the atlas is this one. Um, the atlas should be full, right? Yeah, Sunny Plains is done. So it seems like the next world is bigger in terms of, um, gems, but not dragon, or fireflies. And the last world seems to be the smallest, so, I believe we have to go down this way, right? Wait, no, this- wait, isn't this just where we were? Wait, 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 wait. How do we backtrack to where we just were, despite- Okay, that makes no sense. Stop running into everything, Spyro. Spyro. Using this with an analog stick is way more annoying than you think. do 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 Oh, wait, this isn't the exit. I forgot, the exit portal is kind of like over here somewhere. No, not you. Um, like over here? Yeah, there we go, Celestial Points. Oh yeah, we can go do the Haunted level. Some of these levels coming up are pretty cool. They're, they're pretty decent levels. Watertopia, I think, is probably the worst outside of the Agent 9 level. The two Sheila levels will be fun. Alright, so let's go do Haunted Hills. This warrants a drink of lemonade while we wait for the loading screen. Alright. The music here is pretty catchy. Chatter. Alas, poor Yorick. Hey Spyro, can you help me find my buddy Yorick? He's kinda short, kinda chatty, and well, I'm sure you'll know him when you see him. With all these Rhinox around, I'm getting really worried about them. Alright, and there's also a treasure chest right at the beginning. Sewer Rhinox. These are great. Honestly, this is probably one of my favorite levels in terms of design. Oh, that's a cool sound effect for the uh, jack-o'-lanterns. Ow, a witch! And they just, like, straight up explode! These guys you have to either get right away, otherwise they're really hard to hit because they duck back in after they throw a bone. Why they have bones in the sewer system though is beyond me. These witches are nutty. They like just straight up explode. Are they the witches cat the witch cats from Spyro 3? Pretty sure they are. Hey, checkpoint two. As long as they don't see you right away, they're pretty easy to deal with. And we actually don't even have a hundred of the gems yet. We've already found the checkpoint for the level. That's pretty darn sad. I want to kill you. Just... Whoa, what was that sound effect? Did you hear that? Charcoal. I feel like we've definitely heard some of these names before. Unless I'm just going crazy. Bro, we're only at 2376. Man, these gems are uh, ridiculous to... And another firefly just sitting right here, fizzle. And that witch just fizzled out of existence, that's for sure. Alright, looks like we have to do some okay no, I was gonna say we have to do some gliding, but. Okay, now which way was it? Was it down here that we didn't go? Okay, no, never mind. I guess we just go this way now. Oh yeah, that sniper shot there, buddy boy. I love how there was just a random 25 gem sitting in the middle of the level. Not at all difficult to get. Ow, I knew that was going to hit me because he had seen me. I hear these darn witches, man. Hey, at least we get some health. Nom nom nom. 
We should be getting to some levels soon, though, where we can't actually complete everything again because we're missing power-ups. Which sucks, but whatever. Hopefully there's no challenge portal in there. That's something... Oh, there's a challenge portal. I just realized the Tiki Tropics level didn't have a single challenge portal. Do they really just have a... Okay. And this one is Crispy. Crispy Critter. Okay, let's continue our adventures. I don't want to go in there yet. Witch! 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 Die, witch. Let's see. What's your name, buddy boy? We got Red. Just Red. The most simple of names, Red. Okay, and we went up there already. Boom, shakalaka. Don't tell me there's gems up there. Oh, there are too. Great. When you destroy those things, like that the audio just has a stroke. Oh, this is probably the key. Oh, no, it's Yorick. Hi, Yorick. Yeah, Yorick's a skull, by the way. Hey, a purple dragon. Now I've seen everything. Not that a talking skull is anything to sneeze at, mind you. And then you just pick him up and uh, you carry him home. We need to figure out how to get that 25 gem up there, though. I, I like to call them the teardrop gems in this game, because that's kind of what they are. Oh, we can go around here somehow. Oh, we glide behind the, the minigame portal. Okay. Uh, snipe. And we actually managed to grab that gem, too. That's pretty good. I guess, I don't know, oh, yeah, he's just gonna... He's gonna stop to talk to you. That's kind of what they mean by you, you know you'll you'll know him when you see him kind of thing. There we go. Ten lives. Not bad. Now we're still missing the key. Your nose is itchy. You don't have a nose. You're literally just a skull. Yeah, best to get him back as quickly as possible because he's just going to annoy you. I don't like the green gems on this goop. You know. Um, oh, this is an area we haven't been to yet. Or at least just this part of it. I don't know what's going on over here, but... Best to go and deal with it, right? Oh, yeah. York, not now. Oh, I actually timed that jump. That was glorious. Man, how many sewer dudes are we going to run into over here? Now, I wonder if this is the last one. Oh, it is. Nice. And we got embers. So that should mean that the last uh, firefly is in that challenge part, which means it's not a malt. Dude, dude, I'm just here for the key. Leave me alone, because I know for a fact that the key's going to be in here. Probably with the last few gems before the uh, chest. 13 gems in the chest. Yeah, maybe. I don't know. Oh, boy. He is a chatterbox and a half, that's for sure. Alright. Whoa, I turned invisible there for a second. Spyro, you're turning into a ghost, and I don't approve of it. Alright, let's open up this chest. Oh, no, we're missing two gems. Great. Hey! You found him! Thanks a lot, Sparrow. Here's a glowing bug I found under a headstone. I hope you like it. Oops, it slipped away. Come on, York. I'll give you a piggyback ride. Yay, piggyback ride, bro. And let's see what we got. We got Cauldron. That's a cool name. Now I have to keep my eyes out for a green gem. That's interesting, to say the least. Not really, because looking for one green gem in an area with lots of green goop and green frogs is going to be annoying. I fell in the goop. I fell in the goop and died. Oh my god, man. Just my luck being s Oh, I found the gem. It's right there. That's the last of the gems. Now we can go and grab that mini game one that's over here. Yes. We'll see what this is. Oh, it's the platform challenge. 
Hey Sparrow, I heard you were looking for some fireflies. I'll give you one if you can run my obstacle course. You have to make it to the end in under one minute. Hee <laughs> hee. Ooh, boo. Why is yes and no like upside down? Now, yes, there are witches in here, and yes, I'm pretty sure if you die in here, it counts as a real death, unlike most, like, can you not? Oh my lord. Uh -huh. It's hard to tell, like, where you have to go because of, like, the angling of this game. Oof. Oh god, more witches. Uh, uh. And we did it! You made it! You weren't supposed to make it! Oh, my precious obstacle course is defeated! I guess I'm not quite as brilliant as I thought. Well, a deal's a deal. Here's your firefly spiral. It's back to the drawing board for me. Now, do I, can I actually make it? Oh, oh, you actually have to make it all the way back? Who thought of this level design? I don't approve of this game. I got an itchy upper lip, and now I have to do precision gliding all the way back. Oh god, these witches, man. Uh, yeah, I get it. You failed, man. Captured candle, and that's all of the firefly is nice. Now we can just leave this godforsaken level, which actually isn't a bad level, like I said before. It's just it could be better, I guess. You know, it's one of those levels that like isn't terrible, but definitely could be like better. Anyways, I guess with that we're done the episode, right? So if you guys enjoyed this video, please remember to leave a like, comment, subscribe, and hit the bell for notifications, join the Discord and Patreon in the links below, and I will see you guys all next time as we probably take on two more levels. We seem to be able to fit two more, or two more, two levels per video, give or take, so that way the videos aren't too long. Uh, I know a lot of people upload like hour-long videos, but it just, you guys' attention spans just can't handle that. And not to be mean, but like, half the time I can't watch a video that long, so see you guys next time. Bye bye